Yamaha looked to break new ground when it first unveiled the YXC1000R side-by-side because it offered what it called a pure sport experience with a six-speed sequential gearbox and a clutch pedal, something that had never been on a side-by-side -side before. For its new model, the YXC1000R SS, they actually get rid of what made that pure sport model so exciting, the clutch pedal and the shifter. What Yamaha added on the SS are new paddle shifters that are mounted just behind the steering wheel to give that same driver-machine connection it deems so important on its pure sport models, minus the complication of a clutch pedal. Yamaha invited us out to Big Bunk Ranch out here in South Carolina. And as you can see, we already took a few laps, but we're gonna go out and take a couple more to get our first drive impression of its new Sport Shift technology. The new SS does not feature the manual shifter found on the original YXE, but it does share the same chassis, engine, and suspension of that first model. The SS is powered by Yamaha's 998cc triple cylinder engine that offers impressive performance and a mean throaty sound. Yamaha mates the engine to its five-speed sequential sport shifter. And to make it as close as possible to a manual transmission, Yamaha relies on its YCCS technology for its automatic clutch. The paddles themselves are pretty simple to use. The right paddle upshifts, the left downshifts. And although Yamaha at one point tried mounting them to the wheel itself, they wisely opted to secure them just behind the wheel in a fixed location that makes it simple to shift regardless of the wheel's position. Yamaha went to great lengths to make the sport shift feel like a manual shifter, and the actual gear shifts are felt as small jolts that are transmitted to the rider to give that same pure sport feel of the first YXC. The shifts are precise and quick, and even though it took us a little getting used to, the paddle shifters operated seamlessly on our trail ride. Although Yamaha includes auto downshift feature on the SS, which essentially only downshifts when the vehicle is slowed to nearly a complete stop. There are no overrides built into the vehicle for upshifting. What that translates to to us on the trail is it's a vehicle that doesn't have too many nanny features in place that ruins the experience. One of the coolest features Yamaha built into the SS is the launch control. This new feature essentially allows the driver to set the YXC Sport Shift into a mode where it can accelerate out of the hole for drag race style starts with your buddies. The system is simple to use. While at a stop, the driver puts a foot on the brake, pulls back on both paddles, and once the green light indicates the system is ready to go, he or she removes the foot from the brake and then revs the engine above 5,000 RPM. A release of the paddles rockets the SS off the line, and as we grew more comfortable with the machine, it's something we really appreciated as the day wore on. Compared to our first ride of the YXZ in Glamis, getting to test the SS in tight, wooded trails of Big Buck helped us really appreciate the low center of gravity design of the chassis. We also love the massive Fox Podium RC2 shocks that were even more valuable on the bumpy trails that offered everything from rocks to water crossings to big exposed tree roots. With over 16 inches of front travel and 17 inches of rear travel, we really couldn't ask for much more in terms of performance than the tunable Fox shocks that come with the YXZSS. Now it might seem like the sport shift technology is an afterthought, maybe a response to the manual shifter and clutch pedal being a little too complicated for some, but Yamaha's worked on this for two years and it's clear after our first drive impression that they really ironed out all the kinks to make this system work really well. Expert riders are still gonna appreciate the, the power and the performance of this machine, but it's gonna make it far easier for novice riders. Head over to offroad.com to check out the complete story on the new Yamaha YXE 1000R SS.